Kim Maui Invitational. We are at the Lahaina Civic Center here on the gorgeous island of Maui. All kinds of things to do outside and all kinds of things to do inside the Civic Center when you come in to check out your favorite team. In game two today, Virginia Tech taking on one of the top teams in the nation, the Michigan State Spartans, who are ranked number three right now. Or rebounding is going to be a huge issue for the Hokies. DJ Horn at 6'5", maybe 6'6", draws the uh, assignment of Xavier Tillman and a nice look inside to Thomas Kithier for the first bucket of the ball game. Well, and you see him with the ball beyond the arc, Tillman's going to have to guard a guy beyond the three-point line. Everybody that plays in a white shirt is going to be guarding out on the perimeter. A little pick and pop with P.J. Horn. What a difference P.J. Horn has made this year. That's his ninth three out of 18 attempts on the season. He had one three all of last season, and Xavier Tillman says, you're not the only big guy who can knock down a three. And they've got free throw attempts. Ali, nice kick. And another look at a three, and it'll go down the second one for Horn. All of a sudden, Horn is out on the perimeter knocking down a three. And actually, they have scored that in a long two, said the toe was on the line. So just a two for Horn as Michigan State takes the lead back at the other end. Boat at Clemson. Remember, games in conference uh, for all ACC teams at the beginning of the year except for Duke because they were playing in the champions. Tillman muscles it up and in. They had a great transition team. Good matchup at the point. Cassius Winston and Wabisa Beatty. Very important player for Virginia Tech. Corner three, Landers Nolly. Rocket Watts left open. Tipped up, no good. Kithier again. And a foul going against Kithier. Rebound to Winston. Great screen by P.J. Horn to free up with Bisabidi. Aaron Henry into the lane and lays it in. Back to Winston. Sixth man of the year in the Big Ten a year ago. Off to Gabe Brown. Defensively, you're responsible for. Couture for three. Yes. Great bump back. Ball ready for Virginia Tech. These guys make such good reads off this motion action. Kyle Arns has just checked in for the Spartans, and he knocks down a three. Good cut by Nolly, just couldn't complete it. Ball goes back to the Hokies. Shot clock did not reset. Katura will lay it in. Hokies within one. Potential and a, a ton of ability, just not there yet. Give, give me your, uh, as Katura gets free and lays it in. And then he goes baseline, then he gets a, a little screen down for a shot on the wing. Tough action. Henry, he can do that. Aaron Henry's got that extra gear. Spartans back on top. Cassius Winston, if you're just joining us, two fouls on the bench. Beatty. And Beatty gets it back. What a break. And then what body control and strength to get that ball off the glass. Point guard right now. Shot clock's running down. It's fake. And what a recovery by Couture. Run it down, and one of his teammates beat him there in Radford, who's a spectacular rebounder for a 6-1 guard. How about that? A rare posting opportunity. That is John Ogiaco. Have on the roster. He's raw. He's getting, getting better all the time. But he gets limited minutes off the bench for the Hokies. Well, how, about Watts. The, how about that jab step? Nice job by Aaron Henry to stay with the corner shooter. Nolly off to Couture. Back to Nolly for a corner three. Got it. Wow. Couture, that was really pretty. Nolly into double figures now with 10. Hokies back on top. Watts. Beatty got a piece of it. That is the ultimate green light. And they can switch everything pretty much. Everybody's the same size. Yep. Watts a deep one. Got it. Boy, Watts has made a couple of big shots for Michigan State. Watts into Kithier, too high for him, and another turnover. Hokies in transition. Good pass. Aline, count it! Another three, and the Hokies are back on top. A minute of the first half. You know, Michigan State has done a pretty good job defensively in this game. Great cut. The spread. See if he can pick up number three. Well, the ball moves and never sticks. Wow. Beautiful. Just a slip of a ball screen is so good. There's so many opportunities for this Virginia Tech team. And at the other end, Tillman missed the dunk but gets the follow. You 
Rose in the ball screen from Kithier. Triple team for a moment on Winston. Somebody's open, and Kithier ties the game. Let's see what the response is like from the Hokies. Beatty baseline. Beatty the reverse, and they go back on top. Spohn, it's great to see his parents and his brother Kai here in Valley with him. Floater and his first points of the game tie it. Horn getting wrapped up by Hall, who's playing with a couple of fouls. Tip back up and in for Isaiah Wilkins. Virginia Tech back on top. Numbers. Now they do five on four, and Beatty lost it. Gabe Brown the other way with a full head of steam and lays it in. How about that stride length? He's had it. Marble. Yes, Michigan State leads. I remember that, but but I think I think it should go to the defense. Arns. Great tip. I don't know if it's Marble or Tillman. Either way, Michigan State leads. Yeah. To go for the body. And Virginia Tech needs to go for the knockout. And this is the way they knock you out. Horn knocks down another one. What a story he is. Good pass. My goodness. Oh, and then Tillman tried to make one into Marble on the interior. And it's a run out at the other end and a chance for three. Boy, Michigan State field goals were threes. Good throwback. Good extra pass. Henry with a three. This simple offense. Splits a couple of defenders. Beatty. Aline. Yes! Boy, every move that Wabisa Beatty is making seems to be a good one. Either one of those two can help solidify the four position. Uh, you know, Michigan State's have got final four ability. Winston went to the bench, and Cone just went right around Lawyer to lay it in. Down here for the cutters, and that'll leave the big guys inside. Watch with a drive, and the follow for Kithier, who's just got a knack for being in the right place at the right time. For three, Michigan State here on a neutral court. A slice cut to get Nolly in the low post. Great pass. My Great. goodness. He can shoot it, can he? Nolly to Couture. The ball screen this time by Nolly. They get the switch. The drive by Beatty. Left hand and one. How about that? Boy. Nolly. Got it. A double digit lead for the Hokies. Winston up top. Tillman the catch can't finish. And the back out to Hall. Brown in the corner for three, and they needed that back. Wow, and the ESPN app. A couple of big makes there for Beatty. Winston back in. Henry drives. Nicely done. Seven point game. Yeah. There's the fade. Henry the drive and kick. Winston for three. Yes! The guts. Winston. Two-point game. Shot clock inside 10. Nolly sees a seam. Got it to wow. go. What a tough move and tough finish by Landers Nolly. Here's Winston. Will Tillman take the three? He'll kick it. Henry will take a three. Got it. Boy, how about your big guy putting it on the deck? So Gabe Brown was right with Couture. Nolly! Yes! Oh! Landers Nolly with a three! He's been playing off the ball. Arns baseline. Lays it in. A quick two. And here comes the pressure. Yeah, I think Mike Young would just rather have his defense back and set. And making it a two-possession game is huge. Which he does. Pick it out. Tillman for three. In and out. Ball Beattie, game. another rebound. That How about Wabisa Beatty? That can be the ball game right there. So three times in a row, he has split a pair. Five-point game. Henry for three. Couture's got it. What a win for Virginia Tech. Wow. What a win for Virginia Tech. Mike Young with an enormous win as the Hokies pull off a big-time upset and defeat Michigan State here in the first round of the Maui Jim Maui Invitational. Who saw this one coming?